Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. A huge thank you to everyone who supported me by buying me a coffee. Your support means a lot. In today's video, we will be exploring how to generate a PDF file using JavaScript without relying on any libraries or packages. This technique is versatile and can be applied across various technologies using JavaScript. So let's get started. Here we have a simple web page. I want to show you how to generate a PDF from this page. Let's take a look at the HTML. Here's the body of the page. This button here will be used to generate PDF. And we have a bit of CSS for styling. We have to write a small script for this button click event to generate PDF file. First, we will use document.getElementById to access the button. Copy the button ID and paste it here. Next, we will add an event listener for the click event. And inside this function, we will simply print the window. Save the file. Now refresh the page. Click on Generate PDF. Select the option Save as PDF and press the Save button. Now choose the destination for the PDF and press the Save button. Let's open the PDF file. PDF file is generated but we don't want this header. Also we don't want this button. And we don't want this footer as well. Let's jump back to the code and make some adjustments. We will write some CSS for printing at media print at page set margin to zero. Now body and set margin to zero. Now copy the button ID again. And we will hide the button here. Save the file. Refresh the page. Generate PDF one more time. Okay, now the header is gone. The button is also gone. And the footer is gone. Save the PDF file. Let's replace this old file. Open the PDF. Okay, now the header is gone. Button is also gone and footer is also gone. If you want to add some spacing on the left, again go to the code. Here in the body CSS, add some left margin. Save the file, refresh page, generate PDF, save the PDF file. Rename it, save, open PDF. It looks perfect now. Let me compare it with the old one. Okay, it looks perfect. So if you like the video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more tutorials. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.